Um, first off, Jaden, uh, just a reaction. How does it feel to get your first hat trick for Exeter City? Yeah, it's, it's an unbelievable feeling. It's a, it's a strange one. I um, was so talking to Jono before the game. I was like, I've never had a hat trick. Do you know what happens? I normally miss a sitter when I'm on two goals. And that's, been, uh, that's happened quite a lot. But um, I'm just, I'm so happy. And, and the fact, I know it's cliche, but the fact we won and it was 3 2 and we got back into the game and showed that fight in the second half, it was. Um, it was just a, a great feeling when that final whistle went that you've contributed to such a good performance, that second half performance, we showed what sort of team we are. You know, a lot of teams would, would cave in there when we've conceded straight away, that is, that's a poor start from us, but we, were, we dug so deep and we started to pass, Archie was brilliant, Chio when he came on we thought was fantastic and, and gave us that stability and his defensive work was brilliant. Um, and just so proud of the boys and so happy for Holmes' two assists and then Nicky's cross to get, to get onto it because, you know, I'll be, I wouldn't be able to to finish it off if, if they didn't put the hard work in. Yeah. Um, what does it say about the character and belief in this side? Because it, it was a tough first half and then once you, you got back onto level terms but and you go bit behind two minutes of the second half but just kept believing, didn't you? Yeah, that's it. That's it. We've, I think we've actually played good away from home. You know, It was sloppy from me at Berry. I was annoyed I missed that penalty. I missed another couple of chances so I could have had a hat-trick that day. So we've actually gone places and stayed in the game, whether it be Colchester, Berry today, some good teams away. And uh, we should have got more out of them, but today, you know, we've showed our quality, especially towards the end of the game, to dig in. They came at us really fast that first half, and they've got good players, and they get it into the box fast. So, um, credit to the boys for standing up to that and uh, and getting the three points. It was um, it was it was just great to be a part of. And when that final whistle went, I think that's the, you know the happiest I've been on a football pitch. Um, just going to the two goals in, in in the second half they were really good passing moves weren't they mm. Lee Holmes getting the ball I think he got both assists and Nicky Law playing passes as well it shows what uh, quality Exeter City have got in that attacking midfield third yeah it does you know towards the end but unfortunately we were quite tired but in that last 20 minutes we, we put so many passing moves together you know you're half thinking about taking the ball in the corner when you're uh, when you're up or, or going going for the kill and trying to get a fourth goal which we which we nearly got but it just showed how, how much quality we've got in abundance. You know, the players that didn't get on, the players that are still at home recovering from injury. This it's unbelievable the talent that we've got in this squad, and it's been it's such it's been brilliant to be a part of. And you know, I love all the boys to bits, and and, and we've really uh, we've really uh, been a credit today. We're just disappointed we went on that little slump because you know the table would uh, would look much better for us if we didn't. But I suppose every team's going to do that, and it's up to us now to you know put a nice run together to, for the new year. And now you've got the match ball there, signed by all the players. That'll take pride of place, won't it? Yeah, it's going to mean a lot to me playing this group of lads. I've never played with a, a bunch of guys like this. So after what we, the boys, some of the boys have been through the last two years and last year, it's it's, uh, it's, a, it's a credit to how positive they are all the time. And uh, it's great to be around training with them. They're uh, they're going to be friends for life, I'm sure.